All right, we're in the pen, getting ready to go with the bareback riding. First up, going to be a cowboy out of Canyon, Texas. Will Lowe. Will Lowe, Canyon, Texas. Now, shoot number three is where we at, and if you follow rodeo at all, yep, this is the Will Lowe. United Supermarket shoot, shoot three. Will Lowe been in the Wrangler National Finals. This kid can get it done. We're glad to see him out with us. Come on. Down there in shoot three, we're about to crack it off. You guys ready to have some fun on a Friday night? No, 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 no. Come on. I know you can do better than that. Are you ready to have some fun? All right. Getting set. Now, bareback riding, the hardest event in rodeo on your body. Use a leather rig and much like a suitcase handle. There he comes. Come on. Come on, Will. Let's hear it. Let's hear it. Outstanding. He's on that horse from McCoy Rodeo Company. All right, Will Lowe turning in 80 points on Big Sissy. 8-0 to start it off. 8-0. We'll go now. Danny Wild, Moreland, Oklahoma. Here's a cowboy. Painted expression. The horse he's drawn. Will, nice job, buddy. 80 points. Let him hear you right now. Canyon, Texas. Shoot number two is where we are at. Getting things ready in the first United Bank shoot. Our guys out on horseback, we got four of the best in the business. T.J. Bolander, Paul Peterson, Todd Adams, and Preston Bird. Here we go, come on. Come on. Uh-oh, uh-oh. That is one of those uh-oh. Uh-oh moments when you see that happen. You see that was an equipment malfunction. And they're going to give him an option. And remember, if you got an uh-oh, call Scott Co. But what happened was the flank, which is that soft fleece back there, kind of tickles the horse. And uh, they do give him an option. 57 with an option for Danny Wild. 5-7 with an option. And I know Danny, and I bet he's going to take the re-ride when he finds out what it is. Well, that's going to take us now, Holdenville, Oklahoma. Cowboy we know is Jeremy Shedd, and I've watched this man. He can ride some ranked bareback horses. And he better have his hammer cocked, his powder dry tonight, because he has drawn Ruby from McCoy Rodeo Company. Jeremy Shedd, IPRA world champion, and I mean this kid, he is good. Gus Gallier is our cowboy. Gus Gallier, he's on the McCoy horse called Spruzer. So we switch gears from the bareback to the saddle bronc riding. And here's what I'm going to tell you. Now, this takes a lot of finesse. you got to have a lot of balance. Texas State High School Rodeo Champ, Gus Galliard, going to high school nationals down there. Guthrie, Oklahoma. Now, I talk about the finesse and skill that you got to have, a lot of balance. See, sitting in that saddle, it's kind of like a rocking chair. The stirrup's thrown much further forward than the stirrups you see in our pickup men's horses. They have to mark the horse out. It means they hold the feet above the point of the shoulders on that horse until the front feet hit the ground. The buckering that they use strictly for balance, but when they get tapped off on one, it is like poetry in motion. Right here, looking good. Come on. Buzzer sounds, our rescue squad gonna move in, set them down, reaching out for him, and he can hear you right now. How about paying off Mr. Gus Gallier, huh? And a great way to start it out, 79.79. Sam Martin, Sam Martin coming to us now. Sam out of Goodwill, Oklahoma. You bet is the horse he's drawn. And we're gonna go to Colby. Colby Winstead. Colby Winstead, Banana Custard is the horse. Talking about Cool Horse sponsoring the Colt Challenge, and uh, if you haven't been here yet, you need to attend tomorrow. It's going to be the last chance for our individuals to work with them, so you better check them out and uh, let them know that we're going to have that auction right after about the final competition at 1 o'clock. The auction will be immediately following it. Proceeds from that auction are going to go back to the Will Rogers Range Riders Foundation and the WRCA foundation so be sure and be here some great six great colts donated by some great ranches we'll talk about them in a minute and boy our trainers they're local and they have uh they have been put through the ringer but they've done an outstanding job with them and uh, tomorrow we're going to find out who's the best of the best they're here come on come on nice job all right colby wins 
Winstead got tapped off, and I mean, it was pretty. Whoa! Colby's up. He can hear you right now. How about it? 75 points, 75 for Colby. All right, now we're going to roll back up to Sam Martin. Sam Martin's got You Bet is the horse he's drawn. You Bet. Come on. Oh! Tough luck for Sam Martin. Sam Martin coming down hard. Tough way to make a living. We're going to go now to Trent Bird. Trent Bird, no mistake. And here's the Cowboy doing really well in the Professional Rodeo Cowboys Association. He was set to qualify at the College National Finals, and as most everything else, they canceled, so he didn't even get a chance to do it. But uh, he has been on fire. Trent Bird, he is on the McCloy Rodeo Company horse. They call no mistake. Don't forget WRCA World Championships coming up November of this year, and uh, it's going to be some great action, so be sure Get your tickets now. They went on sale June 1st. They've got a booth set up right over there. All kinds of action, all kinds of fun-filled days right here in Amarillo with the WRCA World Championships. One thing about other sports, they don't have to pay to play. They get paid to play. In professional rodeo, you got to pay your own way. So we want to give them enough time and all every available effort that we can to get them out on that animal and get things situated and work the right way for them. They're not guaranteed a salary. They stub a toe. They don't get to sit down for a year and draw a check. And we'll see what we can get done right now. Trent Bird, no mistake. All right, now, there we go. Getting things situated the way he wants to. And I'm going to tell you what, I watched this young man at Coldwater, Kansas, a couple weekends ago, and, boy, did he put on a saddle bronc riding clinic. Like I said, qualified for the college national finals. And they had to cancel him due to... All the junk going on. Here we go. Come on. Come on, Trent. Come on. Oh. Well, he would like to have that one back. I guarantee it. I guarantee he would. Would you show him a little love right now and dust his Wranglers off for me? And we're going to go now to T.W. Flowers. T.W. Flowers. Here's a cowboy that has drawn the horse they call Bag of Tricks. Shoot number three is where we're at. T.W. Flowers. Back of tricks. Whoops. Cooper Thatcher now. Cooper Thatcher. All right, here we go. Kind of pause. Come on. Come on, cowboy. Keep up. Go on. Go on. Now he reached down, pulled the rib cord, made it look like poetry in motion, and then it kind of looked like a blender when he was getting off. We'll see what our judges say for him. And Cooper Thatcher, 80 points, 8-0 for Cooper. Takes the lead in the saddle bronc ride right now. All right, we're going to go to Wyatt Wells. Wyatt Wells. Shoot number three is where we are, a United Supermarket shoot. Getting them set. Wyatt Wells. Here we go. Come on, Wyatt. Oh. Did not work out the way we wanted it to for Mr. Wyatt. That'll take us now to Ian Price. Correction, a re-ride in the bareback ride, and this is going to be our re-ride. Danny Wild, Moreland, Oklahoma's got the re-ride in the bareback riding. How many of you by round of applause were here last night? Hey, we got a great crowd for tonight. Thank y'all for coming back. I, I can ask them again now. How many of you are sick of COVID? <laughs> All right, we're gonna be in shoot number one. It's gonna be the Hooters shoot. Our cowboy, Danny Wild, Moreland, Oklahoma. Here we go. Come on. Come on, Danny. All right, we're going to see what our officials say. They're going to move in. Get him set down. 74.74. 74.
for Danny Wiles, 74. Now we're going to go to Ian Price. Ian Price in the Bronx Ride, Black Diamond, the horse he's drawn from McCloy Rodeo Company. Good looking animals from McCloy Rodeo Company. I mean, they are gorgeous. United Supermarket shoot, shoot number three. Come on. Oh, click those heels right there. And came down a little bit hard, and you guys can show him some love right now. Tough luck for our friend, Mr. Ian Price. How about paying off all of our bareback riders and saddle bronc riders, would you please?